Howdy folks, Richie aka Bog out of here back with another Bog vlog. Today I'd like to talk about some changes that are going to go on with the channel. But before I get into that, I realize that I usually do like the end of the month recap video around this time where I would talk about the statistics on the channel from August 2014. So I'm going to include the stats at the end of this video for those of you that are interested in it, but I'd like to spend the bulk of this video talking about those changes. So for those of you who have been following me or following my channel for a while, you know that for the past several years, I have been trying to grow an audience, talk about video games, show video game footage, do guides, do be silly and goofy. And the end game has always been to uh, cobble together a career uh, using my YouTube channel, my streams, uh, my Patreon page, and then the various websites that I've either written articles or made videos for. I, I, all of that combined, I, would, I wanted to one day be able to support myself and my family via that method. The other potential end game was getting hired by a video game studio um, in some capacity. But since most of the video game studios are on the West Coast and I'm located in New Jersey, that has proven to be hard. Well, I'm, I'm, unfortunately, I have to kind of come to this crossroads. I have some personal things going on right now that are leading me to make a decision to look for full-time work. And, uh, and that basically means that I can't focus on this channel 100% trying to make this into a career. It's going to become um, more of kind of how it started, more of a, a, a side thing that I do. So what does this mean for this this channel like effective immediately? Uh, there's going to be less content. Uh, I, I, I can't, there's no way to sugarcoat that. There's just I'm going to have less time. I'm going to be going through a job search right now and then I'm going to be doing interviews and then hopefully landing the job and then acclimating the job and then dealing with some of the personal things that I mentioned earlier. Um, and all of that's going to eat up a lot of my time. So I'm going to have less time to play games, let alone create content for it. But the channel is still going to keep going. I poured my heart and soul into this for so long, and I'm, I'm, I truly enjoy making videos and interacting with the, the community, um, and that's not going to go away. It's just, you, you know, we might not be able to expect five days of videos every single, uh, uh, every single week. You know, over the summer, I wasn't hitting that anyway because my kid's being off of, from summer vacation. But, you know, you, you get the idea. I, I, I will talk specifically about the content in a, in a minute that I'm going to be focusing on in September. But I just wanted to tell you guys, you know, I, I've hit this crossroad. It was a difficult decision, but ultimately I, I, I have to uh, support my family. The... The growth of the audience that I've uh, developed on this channel has been growing exponentially uh, over the past few years. I mean, I remember when the channel had like 400 subscribers and now we're about to hit 25,000. So thank you so much for all of your su support. Unfortunately, the financial side has not grown exponentially. It's very difficult to make any kind of meaningful income um, via this method. I mean, I mean, quite frankly, I mean, I, I know this would probably surprise most of you, but if you tally up the hours I spend each week versus what I get monetarily in return, I make less than minimum wage. And that's just not something a father of two uh, can, can sustain forever. And unfortunately, this is the time where I have to kind of, uh, you know, start looking for work. By the way, looking for work, um, if you know of any jobs uh, locally to New Jersey or things that I can do remotely, hit me up via email, askbogotter at gmail.com. I'd appreciate any leads, whether they be uh, video game related or not. Now, let's talk about specifics about this channel. I'm still going to be putting out content every week. I, I still will be doing guild missions each week with my with my guild in Guild Wars 2. I love doing those videos. I, I love those highlight videos of, of our time together. And I know that some of you uh, appreciate those as well. So that's that's an easy uh, call to make. I'll just record when I'm doing it and I'll edit them while I, while I have time. And I'll still be able to put guild missions out. I still I still play a lot of Hearthstone. I, I like doing deck, deck guides, um, showing off some of my gameplay of that. So I anticipate there to still be be news and uh, deck building guides and maybe some arena runs from a Hearthstone perspective going on the channel. Also in regards to Guild Wars 2, I'm still going to be doing things like gem store previews or weapon preview uh, guides. I have another boomerang video in the works um, that's about halfway done. I'm also going to be talking about the feature pack. Uh, you know, those are some videos that are going to be coming up on the channel early next week. So uh, I'm still going to be following and covering Guild Wars 2 a lot. And uh, on the Wildstar front, for the time being, I'm still going to be doing Nexus Talk over on the Zam Official YouTube channel. I haven't made any decisions on that front yet 
as well. Um, so there's still going to be content from those those, those games um, and anything else that I'm playing that I feel like I can just um, put out a video uh, on, I will still do so. But on a weekly basis, I would expect to see at least Guild Missions and maybe some Hearthstone um, stuff on there as well. So there's still going to be content going on the channel every single week, but I wanted to kind of let you know what was going on with me and and, and why there might be a couple days here and there between content. Um, and I will certainly keep you posted as I, you know, as I obtain full-time work and I set into a new schedule and if there's any further changes that are going to be coming down on the channel I will let you know but I appreciate everybody sticking with me I appreciate all my subscribers that have uh, joined me uh, somewhere along this this journey of mine this has been you know some of the the you know this is the work that I've been truly passionate about and and I've really enjoyed and I couldn't have done it without your support for this long and uh, maybe you know maybe as I do this part-time and it becomes more of a hobby maybe eventually it will grow into something that you know uh, I, I can actually make a career out of someday so it's something that I'm I'm not going to give up on I'm gonna keep pursuing but I just wanted to make you guys aware of some of the changes so if you have any questions uh, let me know in the comments below I'll be sure to uh, be as open and as honest I can about them um, and uh, yeah let's talk about stats for August now for those of you who watched my recap video from last month, uh, you know that you know the summer was rough. I was taking vacations and I had this, the kids home all day, so my, my time was severely strained. The statistics uh, reflect that as well. So August was no different in terms of a, a, a backslide in the stats. So from July to August, uh, we had 186,000 views in July and we slid down to 171,000 in August. Just a small decline there. Uh, we gained 782 new subscribers. Hello, new subscribers um, in August. And that's compared to 995 in July. And the end of July uh, subtotal or subscribers total was 23,890. And right now we are at... Oh, we're doing it live. And as of right now, even though it's the 4th of September, we're at 24,691. The top 10 videos for August 2014, uh, nine of them were Hearthstone, and one of them was Guild Wars 2. I thought this was interesting because, uh, you know, it's just a couple months ago, it was like all Wildstar, and, uh, you know, but now Hearthstone with next Ramis patch coming in, and a lot of people jumping into that game. It's funny, a lot of people are jumping into the game new it seems because um the i have a couple guides on the next ramus bosses that did pretty well and i think three of those were in the top 10 for the month of august but uh, what really saw a rise in the number of views are the basic deck guides that i created for new players uh back in december and january and uh, those those uh, videos suddenly became popular again and many of them hit the top 10 uh, view count for the month of august so those are some of the stats for august uh what have i been playing recently i've been playing a lot of guild wars 2 i've been working on uh, leveling up my third alt it's a thief i've been doing the crafting to actually level up quite a bit i think i'm level 67 or 68 i'm eventually going to be working on the uh, cultivated vine back piece um i typically don't like these really lengthy scavenger hunty you know gather farm materials until your eyes bleed type items in guild wars 2 but i'm i'm trying to uh overcome that and see what it's like to actually work on one of these pieces and it's fun kind of actually having a goal in the game again um so i'm working on that so i've been playing a lot of guild wars 2 I've been playing a lot of Hearthstone. My kids both have accounts now, and for the end of the for in August, I was teaching them the ropes and really getting them into it. They're doing arena runs, they're playing in ranked mode, they're doing the next Ramus bosses, so it's all been a lot of fun. So I've been doing some arena in that, and last uh, for the month of August, my rank uh, I think I got to rank nine or ten in uh, last season. Um, in Hearthstone, I still really love that game, and so I've been playing that a lot. I picked up Borderlands 2 during a sale on Steam. I've been playing it with a buddy of mine, and uh, that's been super fun. I've never played any of the Borderlands games before, so it was, it's really fun to have like those RPG elements in there with a shooter-type game. Uh, so that is another game I've played quite a bit recently as well. I'm still looking forward to uh, playing The Walking Dead. I have the Season 2 purchased and installed. I just haven't loaded that up yet. And, uh, yeah, um, in terms of Wildstar, I've been still working on my attunement for that. It's, it's been difficult. I have a couple real life buddies, uh, who are still playing and, uh, we're all super busy right now and getting the three of us to, to log in on the same day to kind of, uh, run dungeons and learn these veteran mode dungeons has been difficult. A lot of the people in my guild, uh, have stopped playing or have been focused more on PVP. We're all going to be transferring, I think, to the Pergo server, 
uh, during this free transfer period while we wait for the mega servers to to launch so hopefully there'll be more players to play with then and uh, I can get back into it at some point. I'm still doing the Nexus talk, um, you know, basically following the news and stuff like that. But in terms of gameplay videos uh, from Wildstar, I don't expect there to be many of them. I did an add-on spotlight last week if you want to check out how to make some extra gold in the game. Um, but yeah, that's really what I've been playing recently. And uh, that's going to wrap things up. I appreciate you guys watching. Again, the channel's not going anywhere. I just wanted to kind of keep you abreast of what's going on. And send me any job leads, askbogotter at gmail.com. I appreciate everybody's uh, support, and I hope everybody has a fantastic day. Take care.